Hey, interwebs, it's Jackie K. It's time. We had to take a break from this guy for a while. But I'm back with vengeance. And really questioning the whole Robot Master weakness system, because I feel like there's several that I haven't used, and we only got two of them left. Right, fire doesn't work, but... What am I doing? I should let this form into three shots, so it's most effective. Or I could just use my Buster that has unlimited ammo, and just go through it. In the last part, not only did I defeat Boomerang Quanksa a lot easier than I thought I would, I managed to go back, get a couple health upgrades, and fill up my sub tank. I think I even got an extra life in the in between all that. So we're, we are definitely in good shape, especially since I don't have to do that mid-boss because I already got the health upgrade. So we can just skip that entire section. That alone just saved me a lot of trouble. Unlike these horse fish that I still don't know how to defeat without tanking a hit. Which I almost just did. So maybe I do, but I just don't consciously realize it. Man, I was definitely getting way too greedy. I forget that they just spawn on the ground like that. Right. I'm gonna hope that that helps. It's not gonna help if it, if like all the health stuff in that I want spawn in the ground out of my reach. But we'll see. Right. So I'm almost back to full health. All my sub weapons are pr looking pretty good. We are in good shape. Maybe I'll just cut away until I either start struggling, <laughs> which may happen sooner than we sink, or we get to something new. Case in point, maybe I'll just see how well I manage against this guy before I think I'm gonna cut. I forgot. About that part. There goes my extra life. I got a weapon that'll cheese this guy out. Anything. Um, let me try Sting a little more. I haven't played around with that one enough. I find it easier to take the hit, because that way you don't get insta-kill at the very least. Yeah, I am starting to think that this is a very effective weapon against the guy. Very effective. So, back to full on everything. M minus one life, which I probably couldn't have even could even got by without losing. And the best part, I get to say no sinks to that whole top section. I mean. I'm getting bombarded <laughs> with attacks in the process, but still happy I get to skip that and get right into... That's right, there's another dragon that I have to fight, but this guy is a lot easier. I wonder if I could cheese this guy out with Sting Chameleon's weapon as well. It might be a little bit harder. weapon shouldn't be so good, and yet it is. What makes this thing so good? I think it's the part that it spawns in the three weapons. But, wait, is it already down? No, it's just making weird sound effects. It's nice, but I'm wasting so much of it, and it's not really acting too powerful. I think the rolling shield doesn't become OP until you get the ability to charge. Which... Um, here's the thing, guys. Remember when I said my memory of this game is not too vague, too polished, because I never actually played it before, despite seeing it a couple times on YouTube? Memories are coming back to me, and I think I remember where you get the ability to charge up your special weapons. And still one stage I haven't even attempted yet. No, wait, 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 no. That's the headbutt one that I was thinking of. Maybe I don't know. 
but I wouldn't be surprised if it was in that last one, because I didn't really see any sign of it being anywhere else. So we've attempted everything else already. Oh, thank god, I don't think the spikes actually count as insta-kill damage before, which makes me a little bit confused on that one part where I got insta-killed by it. But, I don't know. Uh, if this game wasn't being so laggy, maybe we'd be done with this already. You know, it's like I was spending so much time and enjoyment out of using the special weapons, and yet I'm already back to just blastering it. I just got this feeling like that, that we would have been done with this by now if I wasn't monkeying around trying to figure out what possible weakness it could have. Come on, come back down so I can shoot your tail. And just end this already. Yes, it's exploding. We're finally done. That took a little too long. Wait, could I have skipped that guy the whole time? Was I wasting everyone's time, including my own? The world may never know. All I know is that we're at Launch Octopus. I got the weakness this time. We're gonna be in for a good time. Hello, nurse. Time to go to the hospital. Wait, is this it's not... Maybe I'm thinking of the remake, because I've seen a playthrough of that too. But I fought... I fought that the boomerang... There goes his arms. That didn't really do much good. But like, I'm hoping that cuts down on some of his attacks. And if so, that'll, that alone will make it well worth it. I can't forget that I also have an E-Tank on standby, ready to annihilate him. I'm just gonna spam my sting shot until that goes down, I guess. I wish I had a better way of crowd control. I have a flamethrower, but we're under water and all. Case in point, I didn't even mean to do that for demonstrational purposes. I think I'm gonna stick the ice shot because that will hit no matter what side of the wall, no matter what side I'm facing and all that. At least until it runs out. And I can just focus on dodging. More or less. Don't forget that you have an E-Tank. Keep an eye on your health so you can use the E-Tank if you get too low. Jerky key, why aren't you using your E-Tank yet? Oh, I'm out, I'm out. And you know why I'm in here? I wish I could have saved this for a better time, but better safe than sorry, especially when I'm so close. Using up so much weapon power just to get this far. Yeah, just at this point, just spam everything until he dies is my philosophy. Especially because I can just jump off a cliff a couple times, get a game over, and be right back to full weapon energy and everything, and it'll be all great. Now, what is his special weapon? I don't even remember that. Homing Torpedo! Oh yeah, nice. I actually I don't remember what it's useful for, but it'd be nice if it's Storm Eagle's weakness. Speaking of which, wow, are we already done? It's only 10 minutes? Am I really gonna try a stage my first try? Probably, but let me make a separate recording just in case. <laughs> 